Edge's new group, Judgment Day, is taking the world by storm. Edge deserves so much credit for literally regenerating his entire career so late, taking on Damian Priest, Andrea Ripley, to form what is becoming a very dominant faction over on Monday Night Raw. But the question is, we know it's not done. Edge told us there'll be more. Who joins Judgment Day? Let's start off with AJ Styles, the man who Edge named this week on Raw. Now, the fact Edge named him typical wrestling, I don't think it's going to be AJ. It would be cool, though, because AJ is where the whole Edge transformation to Judgment Day actually started. If you had AJ get on a microphone and say, I couldn't defeat Edge... I couldn't beat this. I couldn't beat Judgment Day. That would be epic. It does devalue AJ a tiny bit. But if he joined Judgment Day, AJ would change. And I really like the idea of him going back to the old sort of loner gimmick he had in TNA. That could be quite interesting to bring to WWE television. Something that's a bit more slow, a bit more violent. It'd be very, very fun. But again, because it was said, I don't think AJ is going to be the guy to join Edge, unfortunately. But I think it means that Finn Balor likely will be. Finn's had a heel run before. He's really good at it. Let him do it again. Let's involve the demon somehow. I don't know how you could do the uh, the um, body pain and stuff, but it would be quite interesting to see Finn once again heal and not only that, part of a major faction, especially as a demon. I think it's something we all want to see. Talking of what we all want to see, how about Liv Morgan? She's had purple lights behind her constantly. If Edge could get into her head, well, maybe we can reunite Liv and Rhea. Maybe we could get this look back and totally that's exactly what we all want to see, right? Or is it just me? Tell me. <laughs> but nonetheless, Rhea Ripley would happily do it if her mentor Edge told her to. If they reformed a tag team, maybe now is when they'll be successful under the tutelage of Edge. I really like the idea of doing a full team turn. That could be quite interesting. It's something WWE haven't done for a while, especially playing it out. That could be fun. Now, the Dirt Sheets did report originally that the fourth member of Judgment Day would be Champa. We haven't seen anything really that would indicate Champa's joining Judgment Day yet. Maybe you could play off the fact he keeps attacking Ali and things like that, that maybe that's a sign of him joining. They're just keeping him distant for now. I don't know. I honestly don't. He didn't show up this week on Raw, so I don't think so. And also, fun fact, apparently Edge actually wanted Harland to join Judgment Day, which is insane that they then released the guy. WWE claims have their reasons to do so, but you think when a Hall of Famer like Edge goes to town and actually says, I want this guy, maybe they're going to do it. Maybe. But anyway, Mustafa Ali could be a really good shout. We know he's had his issues with WWE in recent months. They've mentioned them on TV, so you could make this now part of the storyline where Ali actually says, do you know what, F U W W E, I'm part of Judgment Day. And I think he's got the look, I think he's got that history with the anti-authority WWE angles. And not only that, what if they included his hacker skills in Judgment Day? Now this one's out there, but what about Seth freaking Rollins? He's got the history with Edge that they could play off of. And also, I don't know how many dates Edge is contracted for. You've got to assume he's maybe part-time, right? Seth Rollins could be like a leader of Judgment Day in Edge's absence. And also, after the Cody Rhodes feud, I don't know where Seth Rollins goes from there. Making him part of the Judgment Day could be very, very interesting. Especially if you played it off for a while and built to the bloodline versus Judgment Day. Imagine that for Survivor Series. I'll take it. Have Naomi join Bloodline? Have Rhea representing, obviously, thing. You've got a mixed match at Survivor Series. Seth and Roman going at it again in a tag match. 
could be very, very interesting. But nonetheless, I think Judgment Day is here to stay. And I don't even think one person is going to join. I think we're going to get multiple other people join over the next coming months. But let me know your thoughts and who you want to join Judgment Day in the comments below. Like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you next time. Peace!